Hi, I'm Eddie Wu, and I'm a mathematics teacher. As a classroom teacher, I think probably the central challenge that I faced was when students came into my room, they knew, okay, we're here for a mathematics lesson, and immediately, especially at the start of the year when they haven't gotten to know me yet, the emotional walls just go straight up, and people have these very strong uh, senses in their mind of what mathematics is and who they are in regard to that subject. Am I a mathematician or am I not? And the vast majority of students in the vast majority of adults don't think of themselves as mathematically minded, which is a huge misconception. They have this, this idea that there are some people who are, some people who aren't, and the vast majority of me humans are not. And so for me to challenge that assumption, and not just to be able to tell them, hey, no, you, you actually can achieve mathematically, but to tackle that at an emotional level, to be able to say, no, 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 it's worth you persevering through this, to you know hit your head against the wall for a little while and, and struggle through solving a problem or understanding a concept Concept, that that emotional struggle um, there's there's no for me I've found no shortcut to be able to get across that there's no there's no strategy there's no activity there's no uh, one thing that I could do no one textbook no one approach every student in my class was different they demanded a, a new approach a new relational connection and that's why the importance of developing rapport in the mathematics classroom is so often missed as you know, mathematics has this reputation for being an unemotional subject. It's sort of, it's, you know, the, the phrase cold and calculating has entered our vernacular to mean you, you, as a mathematically minded person, purely logical, you don't think in human emotional terms. And I think that's uh, a misconception that needs to be challenged, that people should come to this subject and realize it is intensely emotional, it is creative, it's collaborative, and students don't have any of those kinds of things popping up in their mind when they think of mathematics and changing people's mindset toward that, changing the cultural view of mathematics. I think that's been the hardest thing, but the most important thing about my work in the classroom.